hello beauties welcome back to my channel um today i'm gonna do a makeup transformation and let's see how it goes okay all right stay tuned all right okay i brought pomade from anastasia beverly hills in the shade ebony okay ebony for our eyebrow okay all right all right so let's get started first of all you need to brush your eyebrow okay you need to brush it all right and then i'm gonna use this from juvia's place to fill in my eyebrow with uh the anastasia beverly hills okay it's just a little bit tiny okay and um, drawing your eyebrow you follow your hairline okay i just want to fill in my hairline so i shape my brow in this way because this is how i want it to look because um i don't like it straight i like a curve okay all right okay so let's get started you draw okay Don't worry about it being rough because we're going to use a concealer to shape it, all right? And then afterwards, you fill in, okay? So as you can see, I'm filling in and um, I'm going to use the SS1 on the brush. I'm not going to take no more... Uh, Wrap on it. I'm gonna use the SS to clean up, okay. And then you wanna draw lines here, the outer line, okay. As you can see, and then you're gonna use the brush to brush it off brush it because you don't want the uh the inner line to be deeper at the outer line so you're gonna use a brush to is it like this okay okay so i'm going to use a concealer brush from MAC which is N124 and then I'm gonna use two shade concealers um, the the lighter one is 16 and the the a little bit darker one is 11 so I'm gonna use this for the outer and I'm gonna use the lighter one for the inner one okay all right all right so let's start it you want to do it very gently okay makeup that we do you know eyebrow takes all the time you have to take your time to do your brow okay because you want to look snatch all right so you take all the time personally for me eyebrow take all the time because I just I want to look snatch so yeah and that's why it takes the time so okay and then um okay so you want to tap tap you use tap tap concealer in okay all right yeah okay do you see that skin looking good okay so we're gonna shape the outer lane you want to take your time okay all right so this is how we do it this is how we do it 
this is how we do it. Okay, do you see that? Do you see that? I am looking snatched. You want to use the same brush? To clean it out, okay? All right. So I'm going to repeat the same thing from here to here, and then we're going to continue, all right? All right. I hope you like it. Mm -hmm. Yes. Did you see that? Did you see that? Okay. So look at my eyebrow. I am looking so snatched. I told you. Yeah, I told you. So, so before I apply an eyeshadow, I'm going to use the same concealer. Okay. To tap, 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 tap my eyelid before I apply my eyeshadow. Okay, guys. And I'm gonna use brush to top, 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 top. Okay. Top, 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 top. Okay. So I'm gonna use Morphe palette. 350 and um, see, so nice. All right, nice for me, see. So with my cut crease, I'm going to use P. Louise Base. I love P. Louise Base. It never let me down. So I'm going to use in the shade Romo 4, okay, to cut the crease. yes so i finished cutting my crease as you can see and i'm going to use this uh, shade I'm going to use the line eyeliner Novena. Um this is the shade that I want to use. Blue. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Okay. Then I'm 
I'm gonna use Ev Prama to prime my face, okay? So what does primer do to your skin? Primer creates extra layer between your skin and the makeup. All right. It helps make your makeup last longer. Okay. So it is always good to use primer before applying your makeup it's very 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 important okay okay so with the foundation i'm going to use makeup revolution and it's in the shade f13 okay all right so i'm going to apply a little bit on the right side and a little bit on the left side Okay. I'm going to use a beauty blender from L'Oreal Cosmetic to blend it off. I like using the beauty blender because um, it helps blend everything deep in your skin. Right? So. And with the concealer i'm going to use juvia's place concealer and it's in the shade 16. so i'm going to use this concealer for my under eye okay And I'm using the same beauty blender to blend it out. Okay. Did you see how it's blended in? Yes, if you use the beauty blender, it blends everything in and it defines your face really really good and that's why i love using the beauty blend so with the concealer i'm going to use juvia's place concealer in the shade Cassina. okay to contour my face
So with the powder, I'm going to use Juvia's Place to bake my under eye. Um, it's in the shade Sahara. Okay, I am magic setting powder, and it's in the shade Sahara. So uh, before I put in my setting powder, I will have to go back and blend my under eye again because you don't want to see any crease okay there may be a sweat or crease over there so you have to blend it out again before you put in your set okay then gently put on your setting powder Use the darker shade that I use in my crease on my under, just a little bit of it, okay? Just a little bit of it. Now we're gonna dust off our setting powder, okay? So you see, because we went back to blend the under eye before applying our serum powder, you don't see any crease. You don't see any crease on the under eye. You look. So I'm gonna use Morphe Browns. It's from Morphe. They were doing sales actually. I bought three different shades of this bronze. It's a bomb. You don't need to use too much. You just use a little bit and ta ta ta. There you go. Because it's so pigmented, so you don't need to. There we go. I told you it's so pigmented, so you don't need to use too much of it. Okay. How do I look on my lashes on? Don't I look snatch? Yeah. I look snatch. So snatch. Excuse me. Hey. Excuse me. I look so snatch, baby. I'm using the sudden spray to set. Whoa, I'm gonna go with Maybelline lipstick. Um, I'm gonna mix two shades together after I put on my lip liner. So I'm gonna use the matte ink and it's in the shade 75. And this one is also in the shade 55 and I'm gonna mix it together. Okay, let's see how it goes.
so now that we're done with the lips i'm gonna go with my blush and it also has so now that i'm done with my lips i'm gonna go with my blush and it also it also contains highlighter but i'm not gonna use this highlight i'm gonna use a different highlighter okay so i'm gonna use my blush i'm gonna mix this one and this one okay I'm gonna apply a little bit of liner, okay, to make me look too much smashed, right? So this is the finished look, guys. <laughs> 